I'm really full. Yes, dear. So I'm going to serve you and I'm going to serve Miss Melvin You're not going to serve me anything, dude. Very nicely. I'm already full. Very nicely. So we're going to play a game. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna serve me anything. Can I get some Plastic. detail on these baby hairs? Bobby. Lauren, would you, would you care to share the details of the baby hair uh, situation? I don't know. It was just uh, brought up to me basically because I didn't have, I, to be honest, I right, so Someone listen, told you that stuff. It doesn't matter who told me because I don't do that. The thing is, what I'm gonna do tonight is this because I thought we was all just getting to know each other. You get what I'm saying? I don't really know everybody like that, so I don't have any bad thing to say about anybody at the table. I have not one time said anything. Oh, wow. That's not what I heard. Anybody. Oh, they is playing a girl's day because the girls never say, I say something positive about everybody. Oh, wow. And so, Edna, you pulled the situation. Oh, no, because I was told the situation as well, dude. It's fine. Well, let it be known because we're here. We're not here to be girlfriends. (laughs) 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 She said, I'm not going to eat your food, but I am going to read you for Phil. Oh, bitch. I gagged again in my seat. Lord. We're talking about the last dinner when you arrived well, I had the, and you had the... the... <laughs> so I don't understand how you saw the edges. It was, it was giving very much pick me behavior because I have no problem with you. I don't have no problem with anybody. Well, you was actually looking me down at the first table. No, I was looking you down because when your girlfriend left, you started being friends with everybody at the table, oh. not defending your friend. And then I said, um, oh, that's your first friend. First of all, me and December I said, that's your already friend. spoke. You said, no, and y'all December, can't already we, spoke. Me, me and December are good associates, right? Yeah, I agree. So saying, we've never been close enough fine. to be friends. So you asked that's me that. That's fine. It's good stuff, associates though. and that's fine. But you can't and be real. And you really could have came to the dinner with your nails done. I know. I was going to, but today I couldn't get it in. They said 35 minutes. You know, I got done doing makeup and hair and shit. Oh, wow. I'm so concerned. About that. Y'all can be busy. Yeah, I'm so concerned. Y'all can be busy. I'm really concerned about it. Y'all can be busy. So, we're being a dress from Lorena. Um, you know, she's addressing me. And I'm just like, okay, girl, I can't even pronounce your name, girl. Like, what's the, like, what's up? Like, you just got my address, boo. So, like, What's up? I'm not trying to do anything, but I would like to ask your name. You. What happened? I told you. I met you already? Yeah, I gave you my seat. It's the court. No, I didn't meet you today. Did I meet you Actually, before? It's Dr. Thomas. Oh. Okay, now. This you is what I mean. I'm going to get you to the ring. Get to the ring. She's a Barbie. No, 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 no. She's a Barbie. I'm not a Barbie, no. though. I mean, I'm a My Saint Door. We can do that. She's a Barbie. We can do My Saint Doors. She needs some My Saint Doors. But my thing about this situation is I don't have no problem with anybody, so I don't know how my name is brought up. It's Barbie, honey. But listen, let me tell you something, okay, sweet girl? <laughs> what, sweet girl? <laughs> yeah. Sweet girl. Yeah. Jesus Christ, is he even on the cast? Because I thought we said no outside cast members. That's not I ain't got to be in the cast, baby. I ain't got to be in the cast. You don't. So, uh, so you don't. So you're kind of not here. Bitch, so you're no one. one. No one even knows who you are. Oh bitch, you're a flat-chested trainee that's running through the city that no one knows. I ain't gotta talk that shit, cause I show it. Real ass nigga need to shot to the mow it. If he actin' goofy, put a dot up on his forehead. That's what I call him, walk a pool to go ahead. Pretty face, I'm the prince, it's a bay. Showing off in my brown skin, it's a bay. When the hoes finna talk shit, it's a pay. And when they get down to the edges, it's a lay. Who dare? Piece of cake, it's too layer. That's why they wanna see me. Bow, too rare. Bitches hate to see me. Bow, no hair. You fucking like a rabbit, but it suck. Slow hair. They say I do a B. Like a snow bear, I be cooking in the kitchen, mm, make my own hair. Ooh. Girl, period. I wish that would have hurt my feelings, but back to you, your friend who I know. Period. So listen, you don't know my, my problem friend. is this. This is 15 years. Baby, sis. and you're, you're, you want to be on the set. You want to be in the set. I don't want to be You're not on that one picture. You're not on one credit. Girl, you're 70. I own business. You're 70. You're 70. I own business. You're 70 and growing. Go get some grass. I don't want to. Miss motherfucker trash ball don't let nobody come out to me, honey. I'm Tyron Bryce. Oh. And I am that bitch. Ain't got to worry about that one. I ain't never ashamed about that. It's all about ashamed of your perfection. Girl, you over here with your own. You don't know my imperfection. I'm gonna go leg. I'm gonna go leg. I'm gonna go baby. Go back. I'm gonna go leg. I'm gonna go leg. I'm gonna go leg. I'm gonna go leg. Girl, you're fucking mess. You're a mess, and you want to be on the show. Dr. Thomas, I thank you so much, dear. <laughs>
like to be a doctor so Ladies and gentlemen, that okay. was Dr. Thomas. Girl. Okay. Dr. Thomas. Hold on. Let's see. Who? Your he wanna be on season two. Weird ass. <laughs> he got one second in the show coming for me. Like, please. <laughs> Who? Back to what I was saying. Okay, so my thing is this. I ain't saying nothing bad about nobody at this table, per. So my thing is when it came back to me that you was saying something bad about me, I'm like, I don't even know this thing like that. My first interaction with you was at the dinner. Which we left it at the dinner. So after the dinner, I still didn't have no problem with you. So it's kind of weird how you were still running because I for never me, had no problem with you. For me, I feel as though, you know, you was just a little too manly for me from the start. <laughs> It I think really I'm getting a little tired of these broken promises, promises yeah. right now. It, it was just I'm a little really tired of it. Yeah. I'm really tired of the broken promises, promises. No. But listen, <laughs> it, it was just, and I said this. Can you get the numbers, the the numbers? It was a lie. Baby, please. It was a lie. No, I'm not the one. <laughs> say it again, say it again. Oh. That's my shit. Okay. I'm tired of being the one. Yeah, all that. Go ahead with you. Yeah, yeah, um, I felt this do? Be aggression was a lie. Don't. Did this bitch start saying 3LW? I'm getting a little tired of your broken. Oh no. No, that, did she just. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> From the beginning. How did you guys feel? No did you feel as though like it came off like the aggression was too much? Uh -huh. and, and this is some real shit because I'm saying like. That's what I'm trying like, to say, right? Yeah. More like it's but you know, real shit. it's not because I'm lawyer. I, like I, I didn't meet you until I say, say you're a person. So, I don't know anything. But what I'm saying is that your aggression, how you came off, like, no, it was bad. Saying. No, it was, I think it was a really bad. Upset. And a lot of people I think you were mad because I asked you about him. Because before no, that, we were fine. I, don't I think upset. you were mad because I, I clocked you on him. And you was like, no, what? Am I, am I a good no. associate? I have no, my yeah. associate. And we agreed on that. Because yeah, I bet we you know you each did. other, but we don't know, know, I know bet you each did. other. So, I don't have a thing to explain to you, Mrs. Delphaya. Okay. I don't. For real. Her. I don't know if y'all think like the insults is hurting me or not, but girl, we don't care. We building, honey. Girl, if I we hear, all are building. Me. No, I don't think you are. Oh, I'm building. You built a little too no, much. No, I'm building. Not building. I'm building. That's the problem. And I'm going to keep it. I'm going to keep it. Yeah, a little too much. Because I'm need that a, bitch. You need, a, you need a construction. I'm that bitch. You need. Why and you the, already know that. Where is that bitch at? Because you keep calling <laughs> her name and I'm looking for her. Oh, honey, she's probably stuck in your flat chest. Shit. Yeah, it's nothing there. She, where she is? It's air. Where is she? It's, it's not supposed to be titties there. Yeah, it's air. It's not. She's giving Miss okay. Androgyny. She's giving the girls what they need. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, which is probably why you still be fucking with Lil Shorty because I can fuck with real niggas. Who you probably Lil Shorty? Oh. I'm married there. Baby, you look like you want to fuck your best friend. That's why he'll be a jumping oh, on my dick because he oh, want to be no. he making sure he's not coming at you. Oh, no, dear. Yeah, oh, yes. It's so giving very much really guard dog. Come on, baby. He, he's good at me. Lorette was just, I don't know, she had, I don't know what was going on. She came in there and she had a point to fucking prove and she was not playing. I think he, I think Tyrone has this thing with him. And you know how when people actually like you, they tend to go against you because they like you enough if you get what I'm saying like I feel like Tyrone's problem with me right now is that he probably wants to dress up and wear wigs and make up but he just can't um it's not nothing he could just pull off you know it's, it takes hard work and time no. to be honest I didn't want to come I just came so I can get my yes, piece and get I my seat yeah I just wanted to get my seat the girls wanted to get their stay real fast yes. and I wanted to talk yes. the thing about it is this I'm only staying for a little bit of time, so you do not I have to understand. eat again because the girl eats. Oh, the cool. girl does eat. So the, you don't have to do I'm that. I did want her to come, have a nice what's the name. And my thing with Malcolm is this. I don't even have no problem with you. But she was talking about the girl too, about me too. And my thing is this. I don't talk about nobody. Why do everybody got so much to say about the kid? When was I ever talking about you? Now it's when. You know. I don't remember. You know. And my other oh. thing with you is I didn't like what you pulled in a motherfucking group chat. You was weird. Well, I decided to put December's picture into the group chat because I really wanted to be funny and, you know, show everybody. He talks bad about me and he talks about how much I'm a nobody. But look what he does. And he really thinks this is cute. We already talked about it. And that's fine. But I'm saying because so I wasn't why, here. That's why I came late. Because I came late on purpose. Yeah, I came late extra late on purpose. You were trying to be like me yeah. at the dinner. So it was really mm. cute. Just like how you tried to talk bad about me. Oh, and wow. You just came so, here and just been drama. Who? Yeah, 
Yeah. I get them because we got, we got, we got. When it gets different, when I'm thinking thinking I'm cool with everybody and I'm not, and bitches ain't cool with me, it's different. It don't matter who brought it, just watch what y'all say. Watch what y'all say because everybody, everything get brought back. Okay, so it must be somebody messy in the group that we don't know about. Because how did Loren find out that Malcolm and Tyrone was talking shit about her? If it's somebody at this table, they should just say something so we can understand what exactly was said and why they feel like they need to go back and tell each other what somebody said. Don't speak bad about you guys. 2021. I have not spoke bad about you. Ooh, what have I said about you? After my little wine date with Malcolm, I did talk to Miss Lauren and um, we just briefly went over, you know, how <laughs> Malcolm had a lot to say about everybody. I did not think that she was going to take that information and get crazy, but baby, I don't know what's getting ready to happen. Because I have no issue bringing up anything that I said. Because we all grown as fuck. No shade. Yo, we yo, all grown as fuck. We all grown as fuck. And at the end of the, of the day, 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 day so what I had called this dinner for, so we can, you know, be and things like that and power out. Whatever. Hold on, hold on. Okay, so, you know, what you saying, like, you don't like going back and forth with people. I feel like with you, you have this thing where you, like, pick and choose. Because you was fine going back and forth with me until I didn't give you that energy. Because I don't do that. Like, I'm not a confrontational person. Like, you feel me? I didn't want to go back. Hold on, let me finish. Yeah, yeah you did not. Because, that, I mean, it wasn't really going to be an exchange. It was like you... But I had to say what I needed to say to you. Well, you didn't need to say too much. I, felt, I did. Let me finish. Because you went and put what you had to put into a group chat that I wasn't even in. And, you know, I don't know if you felt una cabona and you wanted to, like, be the girl to, like, come off and try to... Let me finish. Try to bully me or, like, attack me, I put those things out there. I'm confident in my body. You want a body. Hey, you look good, man. What's up? Let me finish. We already talked about it. But I'm bringing it up. I'm bringing it up. We did. Because now she's bringing it up. No, no, no. Because I wanted you because I didn't like how you said. I think that's why I don't know how to say it. 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 I don't Oh, I'm really in there don't like what you do makes sense because you don't like what you do to other people when it goes to you. It's just crazy, but you know, I'm with a kid, you see the apology that it is, but I already see the type of person you are. You know what? It's so funny watching Malcolm right now because, bitch, you a hypocrite. Like, you sitting here mad that Loren bringing up tea when you just be coming in dinners and just trying to bring up tea and how you feel. This is late. Like, sit here and take it. So why in the group chat? I really was just really being funny, but I know it was wrong. I just want to apologize about it. Listen, because to me, the apology wasn't sincere. It was just given like you can give me that. I just said I was sorry. I apologize for everything from the start to finish of our little situation. So how's it not sincere? I don't know. I get looked at as a person with trauma, and that's messy. I mean, you are messy, and it is. It's okay. Because no shade. Just be real. Like who you are. You know what I'm saying? If you are messy, girl, can I read that? Everybody's messy, but my just trying to be messy. See the difference between so you and this is the difference between you and Miss uh Tyrone Price. Because how wrong no. this is the difference Price. between you and Miss Tyrone Price. What I look like calling a girl whole name out. What I look like your teacher, you better stop playing with I'm me. I'm that bitch then. Some real shit. Oh, I'm gonna stop playing I'm really trying to keep it cordial. Hey, you don't have to keep it cordial. So we want to do this. You don't have to keep it cordial. We are. No, it's different. But you don't have to. It's different. It's different. You don't have to. It's different. No, it's different. We're not. Which is why I'm not. We're not getting that. We're giving the table talk, tea talk. We're giving that. The thing about this. I'm not that bitch. I'm not that bitch. If I got to a point where you feel like I was being I keep telling you. Don't let this house fool you, my bitch. That's how you know when a bitch needs you. You get what I'm saying? Because I don't like a bitch ain't coming to my house, nor my door. Y'all to me. Bitches be inviting you to the house and they don't even like you. Like, you got the old thing for yeah, listen, it's, okay. listen, it's, it's, it's different though. Yeah. So you said something about this guy. The difference with me and you, this said something about you know me when I, when I like everybody at the table. I'm that's the difference. Up immediately, I'm not arguing any bitch that don't make over $40,000 a year. I, I mean, I think you would be able to do that. Like, I would do that if I was scamming taxes. too. Ooh, Honey, who's scamming? And Basil. And Basil, man. And Basil. And Basil. Like, you would Basil that big bitch. Yeah, yeah girl. The Amazon's too big. Look at that and bag, like, boo. Girl, girl, you can't take this you because I'm living big, large. Girl, this is and Basil spells spam, bitch. Baby. You can't, you can't spell even spell it. You don't you know what you mean, bitch. Look at you. Do you know how to spell Dean, girl? Do you know how to spell Dean? 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 You know how to spell Dean?
don't want to date. You know how to spell Diddy. You don't. Bitches don't know what's in the store now. Bitches don't know vintage. No, it's your place. You don't know vintage. You don't know vintage. No, no, no. It's giving vintage Diddy. Let's give a bitch's Denny and Burke. Cheers to your dry ass wig, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Big cheers to that, honey. Cheers to it, honey. You don't want to date with my phone. Cheers to it, honey. <laughs> cheers to it, honey. She <laughs> ain't got a good wig. She ain't got shit on, baby. She ain't got nothing else. Hold on. She ain't got shit on, baby. She ain't got nothing else. She ain't got shit on, baby. She ain't got nothing else. 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 She ain't got nothing Get the security. I'm the boy. <laughs> Please. So what is the issue? So my issue with you so is that, listen, my thing about you is I've been up with you from the job. But I told you what my problem was at the table. No, but and I, I still went to like, you. You had me side scenes and still doing what you did. No, so Mind you, I've had no problem with that. Man. I just said when I said, do you like my friend? You said, yeah, you ain't catch because I came in here with some shit. You ain't know. But I did. No, I'm heavy mean, shit. No. Yeah, so I, you know I, what I'm talking about. That's what I'm different. You don't know what you're talking about. When it comes to you, you be like, what? I said, uh huh, what? But like, what the fuck is that? In the group chat, so what is that? I knew it was a What is that? And to so, be honest, but it had nothing to do with you. So why did you feel like How did it have nothing, nothing to do with, with me? Problem. If you, you said something about me, you think I'm mad about the chat? I'm not mad about the chat. I'm mad because you're really weird. You're, weird you're really weird. You see how everybody else had problems and they can address the problem? Something that has nothing Baby, to do please beg the fuck up. No, no, because you're being somebody else loud right what? now, and I'm not in the mood for the loudness. Please, I don't give a fuck who you are, Leo or not. Like, don't get loud with me. Because you're getting loud. I'm not even being disrespectful. We was all having a good time. Like, don't come in here with the disrespect. If you have an issue, so we're not going to take it to that loud to get. I'm not trying to fight no one, but like, nobody's not going to yell at me. I'm talking about me. I'm a sweetheart, but I'm a crazy bitch when it comes down for me going back and forth with somebody. Nobody's ever going to come at me and think that they're going to just talk to me any type of way. Especially no bitch that has on a dry Beyonce wig and a damn Power Ranger outfit on. Bitch, get the hell out of here. <laughs> We already just had a conversation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm really trying to be nice. So, mm -hmm. You ain't gotta be nice. But no, it's fine. It's fine. Okay. Don't wanna talk. No, because she's. No, not we do. We do wanna talk. Tell me you wanna switch things. I don't even know why they were sitting right here. It was getting very much weird. No, she's weird. She was getting very much somebody No, because she put her mouth in something that had nothing to do with her. But on the side. Oh, but you said you lived for the situation, but then no, I never said I lived for it. Yeah. You came in here like, bitch, I wanted to let you know what my problem is, which is cute. I said I live for it. I'm dead right now. I'm dead right now. No, but you said, no, I'm going to sit right here because I need to say what I need to say. Yeah, but you want to say you need to move relax. No, I'm not. The only reason I'm not going to get high, you can get to me in somebody else's house. No, we're in this boy's house. Next time, at the next planet, we're going to get inside dinner. And that's all right with me. And that's fine. Play with me. Play with me. That's fine. My parents always taught me, people always taught me, if a person's going to fight you, they're going to fight you. You get what I'm saying? Like, all that keep. <sighs> Hawk shit ain't gonna work. No, it don't work on me because I know you don't want to fight me for real. You get what I'm saying? You wanna, you wanna, you wanna fight for the camera. My thing with Malcolm is Malcolm just like to throw the rock high his hands, and he supposed to be. He talking about we both Leos. Blah, 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 blah. I get that. It's cute, but we don't give what we give. We don't, we both don't give the same things. We don't give the same aura. We don't get the same vibe. We just ain't the same bitch, and I just don't like this person. Like, I'm gonna go. 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 I'm I had already just swallowed one too many drinks and when the drama came it just heightened my anxiety and it got to a point where it looked like the girls was getting ready to get physical and I am not a physical person I ain't trying to get hit so listen I grabbed my things and I slowly trickled out of the place so that I can go home to my man's because if I pop in the house and I got a rip or a tear, it's going to be a problem. When it came to today, him running his mouth and then him coming like, him acting like, 
nothing happened. Mind yeah. you, I was gonna allow that to happen, but when he just got big like that, all that touching me shit, all that pointing shit, I will knock you the fuck out. Yeah. My problem is this, that we're at somebody else's house, so I wanted to go ahead and get going mm. before I beat the bitch ass to somebody else's house. But when we catch him at the next dinner, or the next talking, if you play that shit, I'm gonna bang him. Yeah, no, I agree. You know, that's why I kept it super just, you know, cute tonight. Because as I say, I'm not coming. It's like, you know, this come. bitch keep trying it. And I'm like, you know, she apologized. I'm like, you know, she I wanna be in the in crowd. So yeah, bad. Yeah, You're not in the in crowd. You know, I heard her story today and it makes so much sense. She's alone. Yeah. You know, so, you know, you I see, got she's coming at me for the storyline, mm -hmm. which I can take all mm -hmm. of it, which I have no problem because I'm better than. 10%. Thank you. So it gets to the point where I'm not really worried about that. Like all that no tickets shit. When I get this ass done, they could be the first person on my Instagram comment. I ain't worried about that. When they is come, the ass gonna come. My problem is this. You bitches is fake. And this is what I wanted to bring to the table because a lot of shit was brought to me behind my back. I mean behind they back what they said on things and shit that you think I ain't know you said. Bitch, watch your mouth. Because yeah. I'm a bitch to take the wig off and I'll fight you as a boy. We can do it. We can do it. And we got brothers. You can get kidnapped if you want. Thank you. The girls from West Baltimore. Thank you. East over here. Oh, huh? They snatches you up. It's like Valentine's weekend, so I wanted to do something special for what we play, you know, the big day. Um, we've been pretty busy lately, so. Yeah. Uh, this is like a nice little time to like wind down for real. Just chill. We always like to get together and cook at night. Um, yeah. <laughs> but tonight we're gonna put together, special, you know, yeah. just, just something quick for real. We're gonna put together a little dinner for real. We're gonna catch up on some things for the new year for real. Um, and just like, you know, get an idea of like, you know, where we wanna take things. We're doing some goals out I'm glad we decided to do this instead of going out. Yeah. <laughs> no, I was thinking, just thinking about like, you know, you know, how's the weekends coming to it, like, and how we like winding down for real, appreciating that for real. Um, Cause we have had like, had like a really hectic and busy week for real. Um, so just having like time to ourselves for real, I really appreciate that for real. Yeah, I was gonna say, not even this week, but the past couple weeks for real. You know, just been running nonstop. I'm gonna try to like find like a balance moving forward for I feel like we kind of are getting a little bit better with that for mm -hmm. that aspect. Yeah, this year, this year we definitely got like, I feel like the focus thing is gonna be good for us for Yeah. That's kind of ironic that last year was such a big year for us. It like, was, yeah. Being yeah. like, you know, the pandemic and stuff. So yeah. That's a lot push, of transpired, yeah. That's pushing me right now. Like, yeah. What you were yeah. That's no. pushing me right now, most definitely. Last year was really big. Um, our YouTube channel hit the month hit the qualifications for monetization for yep. So that was something that was really kind of important to us for all. Not necessarily because we'd like to do YouTube, just to do it. Yeah, you know, it was the hard. aspect of, you mm -hmm. know, just sharing the, the qualities of our life. But the monetization was a big thing because it allows us to make money for all, um, yeah. make a living off of what we do. And that's the ultimate goal. In addition to like, we're able to like invest from the investment for all. And it's also like, it's like, you know, we put so much time and effort into something and now we're finally like seeing the benefit of it for real. So it's like, you know, you wanna keep on pushing for real. It's like it's like inspiration. It's it's a it's really a lot. You know, a lot of people just see like, you know, the camera, the videos for real. They don't really see like, you know, the work that goes in behind it for real. Yeah. Oh. While we was talking on YouTube, I told you that the um So the pen came earlier for real. The what came earlier? The pen. Okay. For the Google account. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, look, you gotta get on top of this, bro. Because now it's time for us to start watching. Oh. Watching okay. the numbers. I'll be right back. Oh, you I'll be right back. Okay. okay. <laughs> Good. Mm-hmm. Let me help. Sure, 
<laughs> I'm always just trying to pull up with you know a nice surprise for yeah. So this here was just something that's like something that's like something that's like I had to do it. Bro. <laughs> yeah, I do love it. I do love the uh, the fruit. Yeah, I fuck, I'm fucking them up. I'm gonna fuck them up. <laughs> I'm excited to see you use that totally spin <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're gonna keep talking about this. <laughs> well, no, I didn't have it. You wanna use it with me? Um, yeah. Okay, then. It's just a little toy, you know, it's Griffle for real, and it's you Griffle. can insert. <laughs> and it comes with, like, yeah. It's a little toy. <laughs> but no, I could definitely pick, like, Lamb Chops over Stick and, um, yeah. Stick. I don't know why though. Well, that's so much for you just telling YouTube that she was trying to go back vegan. Mm -hmm. That's true, but like, I don't know. I definitely could take a lamb over, over steak any day. <laughs> no, this is Brianna here. This is the other surprise, but it's not for you. But it's not for me. It was for Yeah, you have me on the phone right now. It's the greens for me to leave. Yeah, um, you know, besides it's the greens. Yeah. But that's not it. Mm -hmm. That's not it. <laughs> yeah, I told you when you was cooking it, but that's not it. <laughs> well, you can't win all your bedrooms, I guess. Yeah. Just win the rest of it. Huh? Everything else was so, it was like, yeah, smack. I like everything. So we had something. Come on, you don't want to run it. You done? Mm -hmm. <laughs> We have to finish watching TikTok. Mm -hmm. I just told you don't do it. Don't do it. Don't I was like, I was like, how about you? Do it. <laughs> don't do it. Come on, let's go watch it. Trez. We've been together almost three years. It'll be three years in June. And he is a Scorpio and I'm a Cancer. And we just bond. We just have a, a pretty dope relationship. You know, we like to go Hey, Morgan. Come here. Nikki's still on time. Probably. You know, like I should. Hey, yo. How was your day? So, he does hair as well. And we just were able to just exchange ideas and just come in um, from work and just talk about how our day went. My client didn't come till third o'clock. What time was you supposed to come? Two. Oh, they're coming today. I'm sorry. How many people you end up going? I had um, three clients I was supposed to have for one day to show. This fine. Yeah. I called a shoot the schedule for tomorrow. Hey, y'all, but I just said it wasn't a uh, savage weather. No, it was not. She's, <laughs> she's actually usually on time, and if she's late, she will call. But no, I didn't. I didn't see her. I didn't see her today. He's funny. He's caring. Um, he's ambitious, and he wants to be successful just like me. So I feel like we just have a lot in common. Hopefully, we'll get to like walk down that aisle soon. I was a little down today. Huh. Um, just in between my breaks. What's wrong, babe? <laughs> I was just like, you know, we eventually want to get married and stuff, and then trying to buy a house and have kids and things like that. I just kind of feel like I'm moving in slow motion with my career and things not going as fast as they should with me wanting so much, wanting so much for my life. So I just felt a little stuck today, that's all. A little sad. My confidence level goes up and down. I'm in like such a hurry to do everything that I want to do because you know, life is short, but COVID and everything going on. I really just, I feel like I'm just always full speed ahead. And then when I don't, I don't do what I say I'm gonna do or things don't happen fast enough for me, I tend to just kind of like put myself down a lot. I tend to get like really insecure and just kind of feel like things are just not happening as fast as I want them to happen. And I get really down about it. Oh, poor. No, <laughs> <laughs> we're definitely not poor, but we're not rich. That's the problem. I mean, you so, don't wanna stress about it because it's gonna come when it comes. Yeah, you stressing about it is gonna make it not seem like you're doing anything, but you are doing a lot. 
You yeah. really are. You go to man woods. You sell hair. We're making wigs. And you got clients constantly, so. Yeah. And we let the dog get on and out. Yeah. But I still, hurry up. up. Where does the money reside, like, for real? Like, I want to see it adding up, like, we, like we're making progress. That's I all. mean, I feel like we are. But I see where you're coming from now, so. I just feel like sometimes when I think too far out of the box, he goes to think pessimistically. I think that's a word. Pessimistically first before thinking optimistically. I'm a very independent person. And with me being 10 years older than him, I just kind of feel like I move like I got batteries in my back sometimes. And I'm just moving too fast for him. So he's always there to just like calm me down. But sometimes in the way he says it makes me feel like he's not in support of what I'm doing, but more so me going too fast to do what I want to do without really talking to him about it first. I'm still trying to come up here. Every two months. Well, yeah, I didn't really have moms growing up like that. So I want to see her as often as possible. Don't worry, I'm not going to move her in or nothing. I just, I just want her around. Man, my mom was, she was like in and out um, growing up in South Carolina and she had um, like taking a drug habit, like meeting the wrong men and them introducing her to like drugs and stuff like that. And so having an older brother and a younger sister, we were never really raised in the same house at the same time. We had large moments, large, like years of like separation between us. My grandmother would have me and my mom would have my brother or my brother would go somewhere else. My mom would have my sister. And so, yeah, we didn't really develop the type of bond that we wanted to develop or that I wanted to develop actually until I got to Baltimore. At one point in time, I hadn't seen my mother in over 10 years. Move around, that's fine. She can come around. That's all I wanted. She can come around. You know, we still take a family vacation in October. Me and my brother were never really like that close. Like when I see him and stuff like that, we, we, we speak and we catch up and things like that, but we don't like talk on the phone every single day. And my sister passed away about six years ago. And it still kind of bothers me because I felt like she was reaching out for her older brothers and I wasn't around and kind of still to this day, I don't know what happened to her. I just got the news that she was found in a hotel room dead. I'm sorry, y'all. Um, my friends, the little bit of friends that I have and then like my clients and stuff like that, they keep me grounded. Um, I would like to build my own family and have all of those things I felt like I was lacking as a child. But, um, and then maybe if I have kids, I'll just, you know, give him or her or maybe both the things that I didn't have. But um, I'm not like, if I don't like talk to my family members every single day, it doesn't bother me. And I kind of, it kind of sucks to say that. And overall though, I'm excited about us. I think we're doing good. And um, we've come far. Some people don't make it this far. They really don't. So about this engagement. You really about to do this? I mean, you, you keep really talking about, about how much a wedding really will cost. You then. really about to ruin the fun of me doing this. Uh, I just want to know. I got to have something you really, to report. What, what do you mean? Clients. You know what? what? You know my clients think they all going to be in my wedding and stuff. All right, what is that to report it's so, to you? It's so clients. funny. Like, if I don't get an invite, we fighting. I'm just like. If they not at the proposal, like they fight. Like if they not I'm just the fucking with fight. I'm just fucking with you, babe. Low key, just kind of fucking with you. Yeah, no, you don't. Just a little bit. No, you really ask. You want to take the fun away from it. I just want to make sure. You want to take the fun away from it. From it. That's so cool. you might as well pick out the ring and everything. And I'm, I'm not, just I'm not doing that. I probably mentioned marriage to Trez since we started like dating, like officially when we got to like an official relationship. Um, because you know, when you reach like a certain age, the bullshit has to stop. I mean, you don't want to just date everyone. You want to be monogamous. You don't want to, you know, you don't want to be a whore and have like a reputation. It's kind of like, I love you. I want to be with you. I see this working. And um, maybe one day we can, you know, cross that bridge. But it comes up in conversation like a lot. Like this man can even ask me what my ring size is without me thinking that he's getting ready to propose or something. You haven't told me how it's done. Um, it completely slipped my mind. I think by the time I got in the house, I just wanted to rid myself of all of the negativity that was going on. But babe, it was a lot of drama. 
I didn't get to tell Trez when I got in how the dinner went because I got in so late due to the drama and everything that was going on. So I just wanted to update him when we got off of work on what happened at the dinner. First of all, it was supposed to start at six o'clock and I don't think we ate till like maybe nine something. It was a lot of food. The food's delicious. Tyrone's house is absolutely beautiful. It's, it's, a, it's in the middle of bum fuck, but it's a what beautiful house. Um, there was crab cakes, there was shrimp, you had, Crackers and cheese and yeah, salami. No and listen, I was just ready to go after the drama had unfolded. I, I was just, I was just ready to tip in the house. Besides, you said you was going to Panda Express. <laughs> I did. So yeah, but a long story short, like the girl Loren, she was late, and she got there like eleven forty three. I looked at my at my watch. She got there like eleven forty three, mm -hmm. and then she literally, like literally, like burst in the house in her like her one piece Kill Bill outfit. <laughs> And in her blonde Beyonce curl, deep wavy um, wig, and she was just for Solid. blood. She was just, she came in there on fire. And she's like, you and you and you, and you did this and you did that. And it first started with, I think it started with Tyrone. Mm -hmm. So Tyrone, that's whose house it was. And his um, husband is the chef. Mm -hmm. And so he had prepared all of this food, too much to name. Prepare all of this food, and she didn't even eat. She said she didn't want to eat. She had she had her own beef. She didn't want nobody else's. So she pointed the finger at him. Apparently, something had happened at the dinner that I didn't make it to because we was in Orlando, mm -hmm. and something about some crusty baby hairs or something. And this conversation slash argument went on for like thirty minutes for no apparent reason. And then she started pointing the finger at Malcolm. I don't know exactly what was said between her and Malcolm, but Malcolm had apparently. Um, posted a picture of the guy named December in like a group chat because you know they got like I remember when you do like OnlyFans on the Twitter page or whatever. Mm -hmm. And so it was beef between them two. So I'm just looking back and forth like this, like what the fuck is going on here? And it was just so dramatic. It was just like a lot going on. I wish you had came. Yeah, I wish I would eat too. At first I would have, but well, I was told I couldn't bring guests, and then like Jay had bought a guest, so then I felt a little like jealous a little bit, like I felt like a little out of place. Cause I was there by myself. I need a little backup. <laughs> I think I'm scared of Loren a little bit. Well, I, I mean, she's younger than me, but like the bitch not afraid to say, she's not she afraid to say what's on her mind. So strangely enough, when the drama had unfolded, I'm like, I, right, I'm out. You know, I don't, I didn't want to be in the middle of that. She mm -hmm. sees me at the door and she's like, and I got beef with you too. And I'm like, what I do? See you, Charles. Charles, I actually wanted you not to leave. Cause I got something to say to you too, friend. So my heart racing and now I'm like, Lord, me and this bitch about to go back and forth. And I don't know what the fuck I could have said or what I could have done to her, but someone apparently said I said something negative about her that I don't remember saying. She didn't tell me who and she didn't tell me what, but she unfollowed me on Instagram. Really? Yeah, she unfollowed me on Instagram. I didn't know she had unfollowed me because, you know, it doesn't tell you that. Clearly. But then she was like, I apologize because whoever said it, he was lying. I'm like, well, who is it? So now I got a problem with them. I sit so on who it is. I sit on who it is. And I would like to know what I said, because I don't know. I don't know what I said. No clue whatsoever. So I don't know. We shall see. Hopefully you'll get to um come around at some point in time. Yeah, I would love to meet them. And just meet everyone and just get your assessment on who everyone is. Mm -hmm. Um, I really haven't seen Devin like talk about, he's like a musician slash choreographer, he dances and stuff. And then there's a couple um, that didn't make it to the dinner as well. Maybe mm -hmm. we'll get to vibe with them because they're in a relationship. I think they've been together yeah. like four or five years or something crazy. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know. Is there anyone that you like yet? <laughs> of course, I know Tyrone, so I love Tyrone. Um, Tyrone. <laughs> I like Malcolm. I mean, he's young and he's, He's a Leo, so he just, you know, his his mouth be on fire, but I don't really think he means any harm after he gave us like his backstory and stuff. Mm -hmm. I really felt like we had a lot in common. So I would like for you to get uh get to to meet Malcolm. Okay. Nobody trying you didn't. No, I don't think I mean unless there's some shade I didn't catch, but no, nobody tried me anything like that. You know, I'm old enough to be a couple of their father. <laughs> so I don't I don't know. So, Trez goes off of energy, and if it's something he don't like, he's gonna say he don't like it. 
So um, it's maybe a couple of people in the group he probably may not care for. I mean, I can see that already that you know, it's a couple of people who will be like, I don't really like that person that much because of whatever reason. But overall, he's a people pleaser. He likes laughing and joking and stuff like that. And he'll get along with anyone that gets along with him. You'll get to see. You'll get to see. It's insane. It's insane. Because you know you hate when I make new friends. <laughs> Who is that? What they want? I'm just, that is not me. I'm just, I don't know. I just, you know, I, I'm getting to the point where I just feel like I, I'm like helping people. And it's like, okay, I can't save everybody. So, you know, I get what you just know. I got a vibe. So, yeah, I know. I know. I've learned my lesson, I promise. Good. Here, Koi, devastated about <laughs> this bitch keeps squatting up inside of these houses, using my name. Just a complete disaster. I'm hoping that today we can, I'm hoping to see this bitch face to face for real, because I haven't seen this bitch in a while. So, excuse my French for all the languages and things, but I'm tired of this bitch for real. And today is judgment day. Hopefully we can get this bitch out and I can go on about my life and this bitch can go to such a bookings. Complete bullshit. Complete bullshit. Go to court, be up in there. The bitch didn't show, of course. Knew the bitch wasn't coming. So she didn't show. And it was just like a waste of everything. Like I took off, I left work early, and I'm like, okay, this bitch didn't need to show up, but she could swat inside of people's houses, but she can't show up for court. So, you know, at this point, I'm just completely over it. Like, I want to take it to the streets. I want to beat this bitch ass. We need to take her up, criminal. Like, get her done. Well, you know, I'm sitting here, I'm stressed out. I'm like, let me pour a drink. Let me hit a blind, you know? And I'm just like, at this point, it's just like, let me call my best bitch in Atlanta. 19, the bitch went back and squatted inside another house and put my fucking name on another lease, bitch. Are you serious? Bitch, I said I was gonna get Kyrie to come and knock that bitch out. <laughs> let me know, bitch. You'll, you'll, you'll pull a flight. <laughs> I'll pull a quick flight. I need to come to Baltimore for a few days. For real? Yeah, bitch, I'll get a quick price. Let me know if you need me. Bitch, what you gotta do is pay me $50 and take me out to eat. $50? Yeah. You gonna black that bitch ass, both of them? Bitch, I'm gonna knock that bitch. I'm gonna snatch the bitch. I'm gonna pay the bitch. I want you to knock that bitch right tooth off, baby. And anything, you got kids? Kids are free. I'll knock them for free. Oh, you hit kids too. Oh, yeah. Kids, kids, bitches, babies, animals, all things. You can switch to all them. It was early in the morning and I told him as far as like the court case and stuff that was coming, it was a very big deal. And I don't know where the lines of communication got crossed or anything like that or why he wouldn't, why he didn't feel as though that that was a big deal. Um, you know, especially for me to be having to deal with this all the fucking time. It was just a lot. <laughs> we mad about this time. Girl, I really down now, bitch. I got up this morning. I woke up. My thigh was on his, I'm asleep, I rolled over, I held him, I kissed him on his neck, I said, I love you. I said, I'll get your ass up, he got money to go make. <laughs> he laid in the bed. And I was like, I need you to get your ass up out of the bed because I need your support today. This is some real shit. Like, bitch, nobody's creating fake pages on you. Right. Nobody's pretending to be you, putting your name on fake leases. Nobody's doing any of that. So, if for a big day like this to come and you're not present. And he didn't want to get up at all. Oh, baby, he did not come, honey. He sent me a text message saying, that's your problem. <gasps> Bitch, that's my problem. Next time on District 410.
Have you seen that YouTube channel? I haven't. <laughs> I heard that it was very popular too. Well, I mean, it's it very popular. It's okay, but I mean, if you sit and look at it, you gonna be wanting to go to another video and maybe another video, maybe X out of you know their channel. Oh wow, well. another channel because <laughs> <laughs> it's a little boring, but. I mean, they're cute. 